Yo, what is up guys? It is Spectrum Reviews back with a brand new video review and today we're going to be taking a look at the Marvel Legend Hasbro series Avengers Infinity War Captain America figure. And <clears throat> I'm going to get into something semi-personal before we get into the actual review and stuff like that. I was stood up today, you know, I was supposed to have a little date slash like hangout sesh with a girl and it, you know, it kind of fell through, she kind of blocked my number, I don't know why, you know, it's not important. But the point of this video slash me mentioning this at all is... A, I'm reviewing Captain America for a reason. We all know that Cap, you know, he doesn't like to give up under any circumstance. Um, we saw in Infinity War, spoiler alert if you haven't seen it by the way, um, he holds Thanos back with all of his mites, even though Thanos might not be even using that much strength against him, he still holds him back and he still tries when all of the uh, other Avengers are rendered useless against him and stuff like that. And you know, it kind of ties into like what I've been going through. Like I know being set up is not that big of a deal and stuff like that, but when you haven't gone on a date as long as I have it's kind of rough you know what I mean you just you want to feel the you know contact of another human you want to hang out with them you know what I mean and we're gonna be playing some Eminem today so it will be explicit music so I'm just warning you now you know if you don't like that in the uh, video then you don't have to watch this review or you can I mean you you know just ignore the music and focus on my voice and the figure and stuff so yeah, explicit music warning ahead. Um, we're playing Phenomena by Eminem because it's sort of like Cap's... It kind of correlates to Captain America in my personal opinion. So here we go, let's get into the review. Alright, so we're taking a look at the packaging first. Sorry about taking two minutes to explain all that. But yeah, this whole video is about perseverance and just knowing that you are worth it. And you are an amazing person no matter, you know, what you've been through. You can always get through it, you know what I mean? You can always push through it. Just like Cap does in Infinity War, and just like Eminem has in his own life. So, we've got Legend series up top here. We've got Avengers Infinity War, Captain America, Hasbro. Thanos' head in there. We've got a nice picture of Captain America on the side. Very, very, very nice indeed. Same picture over here. We've got a spot varnish Avengers logo right there. Very nice. On the back, you got Captain America. Read up if you want to read up, pause it now. Very beautiful product shot in my opinion. Other figures in the wave. Thanos build a figure. Not much else in the bottom. So without further ado, let's get Cap out here and see how cool he here actually Here we have Captain America out of his packaging. Just a very, very nice looking figure overall. There's only one thing that I don't like about this figure and <laughs> it's kind of funny, but this is the wrong haircut. <laughs> he has much longer hair in Infinity War on the top anyway. I think this is like from Civil War or something, just, you know, dyed brown or colored brown or something. Also on my copy, um, as you can see, you know, right here, the sideburn on this side is sort of asymmetrical to this side, but it's not about the same enough for me to like want to, you know, take this off and then re-glue it on there or something like that, you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, you know, we got a look at Cap, um, his only accessory well, actually, it comes with his um, interchangeable hands as well, but I don't really feel like showing those off since it's just, you know, these, but, like, on his other hands, you know, whatever, man. Nah. So, you got a shield, brand new shield. I don't know if I prefer this over the old one, but I would definitely say that it is, it's cooler than I, like, expected it to be. I mean, honestly, since it's, like, vibranium and it's, like, what kind of technology and stuff like that in the movie, I expected it to be... A lot more useful and a lot more versatile but I mean as it is I guess it's you know it's alright whatever it's a shield and he has two in the movie but by the way people are like oh you know why did my Captain America come with two shields well I mean Cap only generally has one shield anyway so like why does it matter <laughs> but yeah so yeah I mean quick look at Cap here Civil War costume just ripped off star you know a bit darker as well Sorry about the flashing lights and stuff, it's the um, sun shining through the trees and the leaves are blowing and stuff like that, so... Kind of varies in the background, so just focus on the figure, I guess. But yeah, you know. Nice paint apps. Oh, and by the way, face sculpt is really great as well. I really do like the face sculpt on this figure. I think it looks a lot more like Chris Evans than... I mean, this is my first Captain America figure, but like I've seen pictures of the other ones, and they look like comic book characters, in my opinion. So if I did get like another Captain America figure and I wanted him to like have, you know, a helmetless head, I would just put this head on their body. 
Um, you know, so go over articulation real quick. By the way, I know, I know, every review I've done for like the past 10 reviews or so, I never mention how far the arms go out, like away from the body. I, and I will never forget that again, I promise. I've noticed that because I go back and rewatch my videos. Anyway, arms can do a full 360. They have soft ratchets. Arms can go out that far. Got a bicep swivel. Double jointed elbows, which bend in that far, not bad. We're still a full 360. They hinge. Yeah, they hinge. This one's really, really tight, but they do hinge like this. Got an ab crunch that bends forward that far, not too bad. Bends back that far. Got a very nice waist swivel here. Can do a full 360, but I wouldn't recommend it because there's like some sort of spring or some sort of itches. I don't know, it's, it's weird. I guess it's like an older model of the waist or something. Anyway, legs kick forward that far. The kick back, not at all actually. Up at thigh cut, kind of stiff on mine. Got some nice double jointer knees here. Um, oh, calf rotation. I didn't even know. I didn't even know he had that. But yeah, calf rotation. Feet move down that far. Very nice. They move up. Oh, that's not bad. And they have angle pivot as well. Size comparison arms. Here we have the brand new Infinity War Captain America next to the Thor Ragnarok Gladiator Thor figure. And as you can see, Hemsworth is about three inches taller than Evans, which might be accurate, but he does have the helmet on, so I don't exactly know. And you are seeing this right, this is Heimdall's sword from the Valkyrie Thor 2 pack, and I will be reviewing that tomorrow. And then Infinity War Iron Man after that, and then Star-Lord. So it'll be like new, old, new, old for reviews. Um, so yeah, final thoughts, comments, and concerns about the figure. <clears throat> Aside from the haircut, this figure is actually pretty damn satisfactory and just overall fun to play with, and I'm glad I have a Captain America in my collection. Um, other than that, I guess the way he holds the shield's a little finicky and a little annoying to get in there and out, but aside from that, I mean, he's what I would expect from a Captain America figure, you know what I mean? Like, this is probably a pose that he would take on in the movie, and he pulls it off pretty well. Final rating can be, uh, let's do an 8.1 out of 10. Anyway, that has been my review on the Captain America Infinity War Marvel Legends figure. Sorry, I get that jumbled up sometimes. And this is being Infected Movies, and I'm rolling out. I will see you guys later. Peace!